It's about time. Been waiting for your call. They caused a hell of a mess in Moscow. Was it worth it? Adler managed to get the list of sleeper agent names, despite himself. He's got balls, I'll give him that. Bell did well. Seemingly. But I think that team is getting too comfortable. They're acting like they know who they're dealing with. Perhaps. Turns out, one of those sleeper agents is tied to Operation Greenlight. Theodore Hastings. He's a nuclear engineer based out of Salt Lake City. And you believe Hastings is the one he'll activate? Exactly. Total surveillance is already underway. It's only a matter of time before he leads us straight to Perseus. This is it. The recent movements of Theodore Hastings has led us here. Cuba. Right in our backyard. A vacant government facility in the Cuban countryside has become a hub of activity for Perseus, and the likely location of the stolen nuke. No doubt Castro allowed it. Twenty bucks to anyone who can bring him down before me. Who? Castro or Perseus? Whoever. We are not gonna let him move this nuke inside the states. It's time to take down Perseus, once and for all. Team, wrap up any unfinished business. Once we strike, there's no turning back. Woods, don't get any bright ideas over there. Yeah, you've got my sure as shit guarantee. Available. In private. You ready? Let's talk. You look ready. Yeah. Check this out. Look alive. It's Adler's protege. Well. Are you fucking serious right now? Don't get him started. Nah, 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 nah. Hold on. Let me set the record straight. Here we go. <laughs> so yeah, Castro and I have some history between us. I had the opportunity to off the man, but our intel was flubbed. That's in a tidal wave of shit all the way up to D.C. So if I find out that Perseus is in cahoots with Castro, and Hudson happens to find one of my bullets in Fidel's head, well, I say chalk it up to collateral damage. Huh. Kept it under five minutes. I was expecting a diatribe. No, we were after a different spying case, huh? <laughs> That's right. Our team was right next to Adler's when we touched down in Way City. That's also the first time I had the misfortune of meeting Hudson. <laughs> in all those years, nothing's changed. He still has the personality of a wet fucking blanket. <laughs> you hear that? We're fucking legends. Yeah, wherever we go, we bring the thunder. Man, get the fuck out of here with that shit. You seem pretty unimpressed over in Fake Town, USA. Or, are you talking about Mason right now? As I live and breathe. You got a point in saying that? You sound concerned, too. If you're trying to be friendly, this is the dumbest way to go about it. We're just fucking with you. <laughs> <laughs> you should be concerned. Yeah, well, you just snuck into the KGB with Adler, hacked their database, and got out in one piece. And I'll be going in with my boy here. If I were Perseus, I'd be running for the hills. And I'd be calling in a mortar strike on that hill. 
Yeah, for Adler, it's a culmination of three decades of meticulous tracking. You'll probably be extra pissy on this mission. I advise you to stay focused and drop the nostalgia. Good. Then you're ready. Yep. Later, Bell. Hold on. Make it quick. I'm busy. Plan A is Agent Azalea. We didn't pick Lazar for his charisma. He's an expert in bomb defusal. If it's live and he can't disarm it, you're still gonna get that nuke out of there. Bring a change of pants. Indeed it did. Our insider delivered in a big way. As for you, the baseline expectation around here is to surpass every expectation. So from the bottom of my ass, welcome to the team. I'm not in the business of discussing my personal views on team members to subordinates. Anything else? Negative. Even at this size, Perseus could catch our scent on the wind and try to relocate. In this scenario, less is more. It's as good as it's gonna get. The intelligence community has spent years trying to track Perseus to a concrete location. This guy lives between the lines of recorded history. Nothing would put a bigger smile on my face than you personally putting him down. The projector's in the back corner if you need to go over any details from the briefing. MI6 has spent the last year tracking a group of embedded Hastings left Salt Lake City. We tracked his movements all the way to Cuba. We have to assume Perseus moved the nuke there. Langley believes Castro could help Perseus smuggle it into the U.S. in exchange for a peek at the hardware, of course. That isn't gonna happen. What's the plan? The last read we have on Hastings came from 30 miles south of Havana. We suspect Perseus is using an abandoned compound there to hold the nuke. They're working under the radar, so expect moderate security. I say we smash and grab. Parachute in, grab the nuke, skyhook out. And what if the nuke isn't there? It's there. The only reason Perseus needs Hastings in Cuba is to prepare it for arming and detonation. There you have it. Hudson will arrange our exfil while we're en route. If everyone's ready, let's move out.
Adler's late. No love, we're early. Adler should be checking in right about... Park, we're in position. Copy that. We're moving to flank. All teams, we do this fast and loud. Find Hastings, grab the nuke, get the hell out. Woods, light up this joint. About fucking time. Go, go, go! Finding cover. Do the honors, Bill. Like fucking clockwork. Move in! I'll see you man out. Send the main gate. circuit cameras. We could use them to locate the nuclear bomb. Sharp as ever, Park. Contact! Is everyone all right? Bell, sweep for mines.
That's not a no. Jesus, get a fucking room, you two. Mason, you missed one behind the counter. Thanks, Park. Keep looking. There. Hold it. Adler, we have eyes on the nuclear device. Daddy! Someone's killing the scientists! Where? Second floor. Room 27B. Second floor, center room. Upstairs. Oh, Let's no. move. Keep you there, Park. Crude, but effective. Can't keep your eyes off me, huh, Park? Bell, use the C4. We're moving to the second floor. We're pinned down. Move ahead. We'll catch up. We have a little bayhead in the middle of the Canvas the room. Hastings, start talking. <clears throat> Perseus was here. <clears throat> he shot us. E escaped. Perseus would never leave his precious nuke behind. He forced us to reverse engineer the detonation codes. They give him full access to green light. What? Are you telling me Perseus can detonate multiple nukes in Europe? I'm so sorry. Hastings, stay with us. How many green light devices can Perseus detonate with those codes? He can detonate all of them. He'll wipe out half of Europe. And blame it all on the USA. We need to find that son of a bitch, Perseus. Time to go, no? Contact! Chopper coming in low! It's gotta be Perseus! I'll be in the room! Move! Move! As we get a shit ton of reinforcements circling the compound. Don't wait. 
Frost, this is ground team. Confirm you have visual. Roger that, ground team. We have visual. Fasten your harness, cross your arms, and remember to keep your backs to the wind. Inbound in two minutes. Hand out. Heads up, Mark. You got snipers on the roof. Copy that. Bell, take out those snipers. We're just hitting ducks. They're everywhere. Control first, Lazar. We're low on ammo. I think I'm ready for that drinking now. Don't tease me, Park. But we'll have none of that horse kit you call beer. It'll be a proper drink. Get ready. Here they come. One minute. Stay focused, Lazar. I'll tell you what. When we get out of this, I'm by. Now that's something worth fighting. Ground uh, team, this is Skyhook. Your zone is hot as hell. Can you lend an assist? Roger that. Help us on the way. Roger that. Clearing the roof now. Firing. Mark, we need to hook into the line, now! We'll do it in turns. Bell, you harness up first. We'll cover. Go! Take cover! Shit! My legs! Contact in T minus 10. Nine. The eight. Seven. Six. Five. a goddamn fiasco. You go in with the intel you have, not the intel you want. We paid the fucking piper down there. You think this is Bell's fault? I don't know whose fault it is. I just know that Perseus doesn't have a single fucking nuke. He's got dozens. Millions of people are gonna die, and the United States will take the blame. You need to find out where he's planning to broadcast the activation signal. How are we gonna pull that out of our ass? Bell knows where it is. Bell? This goddamn science project was a failure! Don't count Adler out yet. The man has a deep bag of tricks. Come on, a little further. Sims, get the gurney. Like I owe you. Ah. Bloody hell. 
Going to lose a lot more than Lazar if we don't execute this next move correctly. We need you to hang in there for one more assignment. I'm counting on you again, Bell. Sims, get the dosages ready. All of them. Adler, stop wasting our valuable time. He's of no use to us anymore. Stay alert, Bell. You're the key to stopping persons. You always have been. No more half-assing it. We're doing an intracerebral injection. Injecting directly into the brain could provoke seizures, or worse. Damn. Do the eye socket. You sure about this, Doc? Memory should begin almost immediately. Bell, listen to me. I need you to remember. Think back to our time in Vietnam one more time. We need to finish what we started. We had a job to do. Think, Bell. Perseus. Do you remember coming face to face with Perseus in Vietnam? EKG is spiking. Shit. Heart rate's off the charts. I need you to relax and focus, Bell. Your helicopter crashed. You made your way through the jungle, alone. You found a bunker. Do you remember the bunker, Bell? We need to know what's inside that bunker. Do not trust Adler. Adler is lying to you. Do not trust him. Do not listen to Adler. He is lying to you. He is lying to you. Trust Adler. During a mission to investigate reports of a Soviet bunker, your chopper was hit by ground fire. According to your debrief, you woke up in the middle of a firefight. Crash survivors were defending against a PC attack. You ran forward and picked up an M16. Or maybe it was another.
was then you realized you were the sole survivor. You set off to locate the bunker. The path split near a ruin, so he took the right fork, not the trail to the left. Thanks for the... You heard Russian voices from a cave across the river, so you went to investigate. Equipped your shotgun and had a bow with me. That's when you discovered VC soldiers meeting with Soviet agents. Equipped your shotgun and had a bow with me. That's when you discovered DC soldiers and the Soviet agents. Yes, Bell. That was the door into the Soviet bunker. Yes, good, the bunker. Now tell me about Perseus. Ah, we almost had it. Let's run six. Okay, ready. Bell, we've got a job to do. According to your debrief, you woke up and the rest of your crew was missing. The VC were on the ground searching for survivors. You readied your bow to take them out silently. Hey, 
split near a ruin, so you took the well-traveled trail on your left, not toward the waterfall on the right. crossing a bridge near a village. The bunker is somewhere on the other side. At the fork, you followed the road right toward the sound of gunfire. Seeing a firefight, you readied your M16. You stored up a hornet's nest. Chopper Roger that. Chopper inbound. PA bunker entrance you described in the report. This could be the onset of another focal seizure.
Don't stop, Bell. Fuck, fuck! Hand me the fallback scenario manual. Here it is. Bell, we've got a job to do. According to your debrief, you woke up in the middle of a fire. Crash survivors were defending against a VC attack. You readied a grenade launcher and charged ahead. Don't stop, Bell. Fuck, fuck! Hand me the fallback scenario manual. Here it is. Bell, we've got a job to do. According to your debrief, you woke up in the middle of a firefight. Crash survivors were defending against a VC attack. You readied a grenade launcher and charged ahead. Path split near a ruin, so you took the well-traveled trail on your left, not toward the waterfall on the right. at the bunker across the bridge. You went left at the fork, not right. A few allies were pinned down on a ridge. You readied your sniper rifle to assist.
Inside the house hit by napalm, you find a hidden bunker door. Well, check it out, pal! I don't care if the door was fucking stuck, open it! Give Bell another injection. That could be. Do it now! Bell's heart rate is already. Heart rate is spiking. I'm not sure how much longer Bell can last. Good. Everything's stabilized. Heart rate is coming down now. Stop wasting my time with this hallway. Turn around. Forget about the damn lab. I need to know about the bunker. Comrades, the United States and its allies slowly consume her. I'll survive another round. Now you're asking me. Do it. We're not leaving empty handed. Script 17. Ready. Bell, we've got a job to do. We've been over this already. Skip ahead to the next part. The bunker door was right there at the ruins, Bell. You went in. Bell, go into the bunker now. You're the only one who knows where Perseus is. <laughs> 
where he'll detonate the nukes. Where is he, Bell? Comrades, the United States and its allies slowly consume that which is dear to us. Our leaders continue to weaken under this threat. It is the moral duty of Perseus to act when they will not. Soon we will possess an American nuclear bomb. The key to unlocking their entire green light arsenal. Once we control the green light arsenal, we will detonate them all from the safety of Solovetsky. their mind is a difficult and painful process. That's a small price to pay. The CIA's mind control program has had a great deal of success with implanted memories. You want me to tell them about my time in Vietnam? Lastly, you'll need a command phrase to trigger the implanted memories. We have a job to do. We have a job to do. You had to reach the Soviet bunker. It appears the subject's programming is beginning to take hold. We've got a job to do. We've known each other for years, fought together, bled together, been through the hell of Vietnam together. We've got a job to do. And now the training's complete. We just need to give the subject a name. Bell. <laughs>